Bill Hargis has served the City of Woodbury in public office for 18 years. He joined the City Council in 1992, then became Woodbury's mayor in September 1993. With more than 17 years as the city's top elected official, Bill is the longest serving mayor in Woodbury history. I remember when the evening that we appointed Bill to the City Council the first time, we had had a number of meetings filled with some uh, unpolite discourse. Uh, we had some dissension in the city about some special use permits or something. At one point, the prior mayor had come storming into the council chambers. He had been watching at home. He said, this is no way to run a city. He was very upset. It was Dan Geider. So when there was an opportunity to appoint someone to the uh, city council, we chose Bill Hargis because of his involvement in the city and his understanding of economic development. And he proved to be a spectacular choice. In a couple of years, when we had another unfortunate occasion to need to appoint a mayor, we appointed Bill the mayor and he's been a tremendous contribution to the city. During the Hargis era, Woodbury has been one of Minnesota's fastest growing cities. The population more than doubled, increasing from about 27,000 in 1993 to approximately 60,000 in 2010. The number of households grew from 9,400 to 22,600. To serve this expanding population, the city added numerous and diverse residential neighborhoods that provide a wide choice of housing options. It expanded municipal buildings, including City Hall, Public Safety and Public Works, and built three new fire stations. The city encouraged commercial development in order to expand the tax base and bring more jobs to Woodbury. And it developed the infrastructure needed to support growth, including two freeway interchanges. Mayor Hargis continued Woodbury's tradition of careful planning guiding the city as it evolved from a small bedroom community of St. Paul into a full-service Twin Cities metropolitan area city. When I moved to Woodbury, we were in the middle of an unprecedented housing boom. We were growing at the rate of 1,600 housing units per year, which made Woodbury the fastest growing uh, community in Minnesota and one of the fastest growing uh, communities in the nation. Residents at that time identified growth as their number one concern. Under Bill Hargis's leadership, we began a comprehensive planning process and through that process we developed our growth management policy. That policy has proven to be extremely uh, successful in managing uh, our growth here in the community and in fact has been uh, copied by many communities across the nation and it would not have been possible in my view to develop that policy without uh, the good efforts of our mayor Bill Hargis. Woodbury has many amenities that contribute to the city's high quality of life one of its principal assets is the park and trail system. The city's residential neighborhoods are connected by more than 125 miles of multi-use trails and surrounded by 3,000 acres of dedicated parkland. Most of the recreational facilities that residents use and value today were developed while Bill Hargis was mayor. During Bill Hargis's tenure, Woodbury voters approved three parks and open space referendums. The first, in 1994, raised $9.1 million, which was used primarily to build Bielenberg Sports Center. In 1998, voters approved a $5 million referendum with the funds earmarked entirely for open space preservation. Then in 2005, a $9 million referendum provided another $6 million for open space acquisition and $3 million for expanding the outdoor facilities at Bielenberg Sports Center. Athletic fields and ice arenas were not the only recreational facilities constructed while Bill served as mayor. In the heart of Woodbury is Central Park and Lookout Ridge, Woodbury's unique indoor park and playground. Since it opened in 2002, Central Park has been a hub of activity year-round, linking the R.H. Stafford Library and the YMCA. It is a prime example of the cooperative agreements and joint use of facilities fostered by Mayor Hargis. It was initial discussion about how could we create a sense of gathering for our citizens when Woodbury did not have a downtown area. And from those initial discussions, we came up with the concept of Central Park. It is built like a shopping center, and we have our anchor stores, which is the senior housing complex, the library, YMCA, and ECFE. So it is a facility enjoyed by all uh, age groups, and the core then is the city's central park, which is our, the crossroads. 
As Woodbury has grown, the mayor has understood the importance of economic development, both to diversify the tax base and to provide good jobs within the city. He has been actively involved with the Economic Development Commission, which implemented several strategic plans during his tenure. Woodbury today is home to a thriving commercial community consisting of more than a thousand businesses. Major employers include the Hartford, Assurant Financial Services, and EcoWater Systems. The city also has attracted major retail development. Since 1993, Woodbury has added more than 7 million square feet of new commercial construction. Under Bill's leadership, the focus has remained on places to work, with office and industrial development the city's top priority. Bill is a businessman and actually has, has done development work, and so I think his relationship with developers who came to the city with proposals, there was a real understanding there. Bill had credibility uh, with these people because he was familiar with it. And I think he was able to talk their language to understand what the problems were, what the benefits were, what the importance was of visibility and access and location. Vital to Woodbury's economic and residential growth was a transportation system that could serve the needs of businesses and residents. Mayor Hargis understood the importance of regional representation in advocating for improvements. He has served for many years on the Metropolitan Council's Transportation Advisory Board, which allocates federal and state money for transportation projects in the metropolitan area. Woodbury constructed both the Lake Road Interchange and the Tamarack Road Interchange on 494 during the Hargis years. The city also worked diligently to ensure the reconstruction of the Valley Creek Road Interchange at I-494. The city added park and ride lots for bus riders and urged Metro Transit to provide express service to downtown Minneapolis in addition to commuter bus service to downtown St. Paul. Transportation funding is one of the most difficult challenges that a growing city faces. Nearly all the principal roads in Woodbury are under the jurisdiction of the state of Minnesota or Washington County. And Bill played a key role in securing the participation of these agencies in the long list of road improvements that were done during his tenure. It's really thanks to Bill's leadership that Woodbury now has a road system that will serve its residents far into the future. While leading Woodbury through a period of tremendous growth, the mayor has provided leadership and direction in all the areas that are critical to the continuing development of the city. But Bill Hargis' legacy is far more than roads, water wells, parks, and freeway interchanges. With his small town Iowa roots, Mayor Hargis has understood the importance of fostering community, of encouraging residents to take an active role in local organizations, churches, youth athletic teams, and city advisory boards. He has led by example, demonstrating through his involvement with the Woodbury Community Foundation and other organizations the commitment he would ask others to make. Bill has supported and encouraged policies that ensure Woodbury is welcoming to people of all ages, races, creeds, and income levels. The mayor was recognized by Habitat for Humanity for his support as the city partnered with Habitat in developing affordable housing in Woodbury. One of our big challenges was affordable housing. This was a new term and people were very unfamiliar with what affordable housing meant. Bill led us through that very clearly and concisely because he understood how important it was to have people from all walks of life living in our city and supporting our city. Bill Hargis may be retiring from public office, but his imprint on the city will endure. His vision, hard work, and dedication to Woodbury will long be remembered by a grateful community. One of Bill's favorite quotes is, the world belongs to those who show up. And Bill has really shown up over the past 18 years as council member and then as mayor for the last 17 years. His work ethic and his vision to the community has really led us through a lot of challenges, which again, to quote Bill, are opportunities and work close. So those challenges have been met and we've really grown as a community and are now one of the leading communities in the Midwest. So he's made an indelible mark on the community. He will long be remembered by our grateful staff members and citizens alike. Thank you, Bill.